Good morning, you guys. I know, I'm so sorry about my voice. Um, <clears throat> I'm afraid my voice may sound like this all day, so I'm so sorry, um, but I'm sick. I'm making coffee right now. It's Monday, so happy Monday. Um, I hope you guys had a great weekend and had a good time, whatever you did. And <clears throat> we're back to reality. Isn't how that? Isn't it kind of sad how that works? Um, <clears throat> As today, it's just gonna be a normal Monday. I'm gonna try to homeschool. Um, I don't, my, I'm losing my voice and I really don't feel well. Um, so we'll see, we'll get done what we can get done. Maybe the coffee will actually help me get my voice back. On top of it, it's actually painful <laughs> to try to talk. So my girls will be like, yes, mommy can talk. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna sit down and drink my coffee and um, we'll see what the day holds. So yeah, see you in a little bit. Good girl, Miss Oakley's resting on her bed. Everybody's doing school. Evie's wearing the abominable snowman vest because it's cold. Um, <clears throat> yeah, and Brenda's freezing. Everybody's cold. So funny, so the little ones are doing school but their Legos are not far from them. Cap is um, doing some spelling. Seb is working on his kindergarten stuff. Eve is working on, you're doing your spelling, doing and Bryn is doing math, so yeah. Good, Bryn's already done her spelling. That's what's going on today, well not today, that's what's going on. <laughs> that's what's going on right yeah. now. Good job. Um, yeah, it's chilly, but you know what, I was looking at the weather, and I don't know where you guys live, um, <laughs> but it looks like Tomorrow is going to be in the 70s, but I think it's going to rain, so that's kind of like cancels that out. Let's see, 74, and then Wednesday 77. Um, I'm happy about that. You know that I like warm weather, but I remember last um, Christmas it was so warm, and and I think this was Christmas Eve, and it probably carried into Christmas Day, but Christmas Eve was so warm that um, I stayed home to like wrap some presents. And um, Daniel took all the kids on a hike um, in our neighborhood, which leads, which there's streams and stuff along the hike, and it goes to a big river. Wait, but anyways, on Christmas Day too. <clears throat> oh, hang on. Um, anyways, they were all in shorts and t-shirts and got and played in the water. It was that warm. I don't know if you guys remember, but um, and the humidity, it was crazy. We we're okay with that, like. Really? I mean, snow is fun, and we love snow. But if I had, to, if I could choose, like 80 degrees and sand and palm trees on Christmas Day, I would totally choose that in a heartbeat. Um, our dream is to move to Florida one day, and um, we, I don't know. We hope that we could actually make that true sometime. I mean, we love living here. We love our neighborhood, and we love our neighbors, and we feel very blessed to have the neighborhood that we have. And the friends, the friendships that we've made and the friendships that the kids have made has been, has been fun. And, you know, Evie, <clears throat> for the first time, you know, it, it can run down the street and go play with a friend. And they all grab their bikes and they go bike riding. And it's just like, we feel very blessed. And don't we? We have fun. And the kids have fun playing outside. And yeah. So anyways, hopefully... You guys have a similar experience in um, in your neighborhood. We enjoy it. All right, guys, I'm gonna. I'm holding, resting my arm. I'm tired. Um, we're gonna get back I to school. Thanks. Okay. See you later.
posted this a picture of my lunch before I started digging in on Instagram and, and it made me realize two things one I wanted to show you what I had for lunch because it's gluten-free and two to follow me on Instagram I haven't um, I, not many people I don't think know about my Instagram account um, or follow me so I'll link it down below um, I always do check the description box because I put information there so don't forget to check um, but my Instagram is um, the rich dot life so I'll link it below follow me that would be wonderful but here's my lunch I just found some vegetables literally where we need to go to the grocery store I don't think I'm gonna go till Wednesday so we're just kind of cleaning out the fridge and I just kind of found the vegetables that I had broccoli carrots um, celery garlic onion you know, sauteed that in coconut oil um, and I use gluten-free soy sauce gluten <laughs> If you're gluten free, you uh, hopefully you know soy sauce, traditional soy sauce is full of gluten. So um, just make sure it's gluten free. And then I bought, I bought, well, I mean, I cooked, gluten, excuse me, my voice, it's, it's, it's hard to talk. Um, gluten free noodles, and it's these right here by Lotus Foods. So, um, and the, the kids, I know, the kids love them. <clears throat> and I did, I just put um, cheese on theirs. Like parmesan cheese but um um so then i just i used that and um put some lime squirted some lime a little bit more soy sauce and, oh and an egg i stir fried an egg in there that's my lunch so yeah we're gonna get back at to eating what um i am making dinner and i was gonna show you what i am making so i'm doing um little like mini meatloafs i'm sure you've seen that before <clears throat> excuse me so sorry um and oh let me just show you so here they are it's just um meatloaf but put in muffin tins it cooks faster and the kids seem to like it a little bit better and um i, I didn't really follow a recipe but um hang on let me tell them to be quiet okay it's getting loud it's just ground beef um, I put gluten-free breadcrumbs, an egg, salt, garlic powder, pepper, what else? Um, salsa. I put salsa in it. Um, and then I'm going to cover it with like a sauce, and I just made it with ca um, mustard, ketchup, apple cider vinegar, and brown sugar, and I'll put that on top. And by the way, this is the salt that I use. Um, it's the Himalayan salt, and um, I don't use white salt anymore. This is pretty much, and this is actually good for you. Like, this isn't bad to eat. So, I use this is the salt that I use. And yeah, and we're gonna have mashed potatoes and broccoli. That will be dinner. What you doing, Bones? <coughs> My voice is shot. It's done. Cap, say something. I'm a little turtle. I'm a little turtle. What do you want me to say? Um, <laughs> I'm like, what do you want me to say? I don't know. I have to whisper. It's the quiet place. So once I had a dream of like, we are at school and I asked, this girl, she, she said, she said, we're gonna go something, so, somewhere for school, and then I'm like, and then, and then I'm, and then I picture it in my head, and then I'm like, does it have tornadoes there in my dream? And then she's, and I came down in Sebi's bed, and I'm like, does it have tornadoes there? And then she's, and then she didn't say anything, and then she's just like, this is the quiet place. But I, she didn't even say like, not tornadoes. Like she didn't even say, and I said, "How long? How long are we gonna stay there?" And she said, "For a hundred days." Oh it was okay. so weird. It was so weird. Okay, I have no voice, and it's exhausting. I have breath. Daniel, close it out. Go ahead and close that. Since you can't. All right, it's been fun, guys. Here I am, finally back home from work and closing out the pod since Kendall has no voice. And uh, 
Yeah. Well, thank you for watching. Subscribe, subscribe and like, our, like videos, our videos, and comment down below. And we love you guys. Bye. Christy just learned a very valuable lesson. <laughs> We can blame it on the wine, but check out these cookies. Oh, they're ready.